but he's on the airfield. Come on, give me that bomb hit. There we go. Right, all the bombs hit too. Good. And we made it away. Now what? Uh oh. We'll go up here and try to find another airfield, I guess. In the meantime. Hey, found one. Nice, 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 nice. Let's go get some score. And some silver lions, hopefully. There's one. That's an airfield right there. Oh, yeah. Excellent. I'm about west. Roughly west. Not quite fully west, because I think it was a little more north than straight west. Yep, there it is. Never mind. We can go straight west. Oh, yeah. Beautiful. Alright, we're looking good. Let's roll it on in. Oh, somebody's taking off down there. Do not have a good picture on the bombs, though. You and eight for you. Let's get the hell out of here. one hit. We might still be flyable? Oh no, we lost the ends of our wings. Never mind. We might be able to make it home. I don't know though. Almost made it out of there. We almost made it out of there clean. We apparently seem to be flyable. What happens if I whip it up here? Are we going to have the same wing sweep problems with speed, I wonder? Can't imagine we're going to be flyable enough to make it all the way back home. Engine number two has a little bit of damage, but it isn't reading any differently than engine one. Huh. Well, we'll try to make it home. I don't think we're going to, but we're going to try. Nah, I don't see that happening. I'm gonna fight it though. We have captured a zone. Nah, our speed is way too bad to make it all the way home. Even with full afterburner. Yep, we're coming down. 
Yep. Ooh. Well, I mean, probably some spinal injury. Certainly going to be some soft tissue damage from this landing, but I'd say, all things considered, we might have survived this and been able to start walking north. Maybe. Maybe. Bombay doors open. Roll in on target. We are way up here this time. Getting pretty slow. Alright, let's... Oh. Darn it. Target is almost completely obscured with clouds. What a shame. Alright, I want to hit the runway this time. Hope we can actually see it. Oh, there we go. Okay. Why did the... Hello? Okay. Okay, all my bombs did hit. And apparently the Rolands can't see through sm uh, clouds. Because they should definitely be shooting at me at this point. Alright. I'll take that. Attention to the map! Guide on me! <laughs> Some uh, traffic controller is about to get fired. We have an A20. Okay. That works, I suppose. That was that was one of the more entertaining landings I've had, that's for sure. And this time it wasn't even all because of me and my landing. So we're heading up to an airfield right over here. I just saw it. I rolled the plane over and was looking down at the ground and I visually acquired it. So we should pick it up with the... Uh, any second now it should uh, pop up. I actually flew past this airfield. I came down and flew right here all the way across, and it didn't detect it. So there may be more airfields over here, or maybe even up farther, that I just didn't see. But there we go. There it is. This one should be easier to bomb. There's less clouds over it. That's why I went looking for the new airfields. Oh, yeah. Much better. Much better. Except for the part where we're going to get shot down, which is definitely going to happen. Oh, nice. I got a plane. Doesn't matter. We're bailing out. But, hey, whatever. All right. 16 BLU-1 napalm bombs because, well, why the hell not? Got to try them at least once. So, um... I didn't have time to make a preset. Well, it's not that I didn't have time. I just forgot to do it before I started. And you can't make a preset from the lobby, which makes sense. So we're going in with just the 16. No sidewinders, no cannon, no extra bomb in the bomb bay, anything like that. So we'll see what kind of damage and score we can get with uh, 16 of these things. And then we'll go back to the normal presets after that. Most likely. Kind of funny, though. Oh, yeah, there we go. 
easily found a runway. Normal spot. Good. Bring it straight west. You're ready to go in for the dive. The uh, napalm bombs have roughly the same drag penalty as the rocket pods, it seems. So, they're okay. But they definitely have a pretty significant drag on them. We're doing alright, but every the turn really... We were basically right at stall speed when we turned, but that's alright. It essentially is telling me that there's probably going to be no point to using the napalm bombs and anything other than maybe sim battles, but probably not even that, so. Ah, right, here we go. I got it marked to just drop all 16 all at once because it's not really any point in doing anything else. Let's roll in. Maybe we can egress back out of here alive at that point. I also think it'll be funny to... Ooh, somebody's down there. I think it'd be really funny to drop them on their runway and see if anybody tries to take off or land through it. Really entertaining to me. If I can just find the... Uh... Alright, got him off. I was hoping to egress, but I didn't have the... Uh... Oh, we ought to be able to see the napalm here, I hope. Nope, apparently not. Those will hit before too long, and we definitely got them off, so we'll check in on the uh, damage here shortly. Oh. Okay. Ah, there we go. It's burning. <laughs> It'll be interesting to see how much damage happens over time. We'll, we'll check back in on that in a little bit. Yeah, I'm getting more damage as it goes. That's funny. That I like. So... Um, I did an airstrike on the airfield and I forgot to check my score. However, it was about .4 something of actual base damage and 700 and something, 780 something. So, probably not really worth it, but it was funny. And I think it would be really entertaining if you actually caught somebody taking off or landing and got napalm on the runway in front of them to see if it actually damaged their airplane. I don't know that it would. If you dropped it right on top of them where they were parked, like the F, you know, the AI F-86s or Hunters, I'm sure you would actually destroy them. But I don't know if anybody taxied through it on takeoff or rolled through it on landing if it would actually cause any damage to their airplane. I kind of doubt it. Maybe a little. I don't think it would kill them, though. But it'd be funny to do it. Hey, somebody found another airfield. Very nice. Except for rockets. And let's roll them in. Anybody down there? Okie doke. It is time. Anybody down there? a bit low. I think we can get out of here. Probably get a rolling fired after us at a certain point. Maybe not.
God knows how many of those rockets hit. I started firing them a bit earlier than I probably should have, but we'll see. Okay. I think we're making an egress here. Well, that was a big chunk of their score gone, and when our guys finish capturing A, which I'm trying to get to and help, but I don't think I'm going to make it, that will be a big help too. I can boost my throttle up a little bit, but I'm already pretty much flying at rip speed, almost, and I don't think I'm going to make it into A to help. But that's okay. It's going to be close. I don't think I'm quite going to squeeze in there. I don't know, it's going to be a close one. I think I'm going to be just short. I don't know. Are we going to make it? I think we're going to make it. Oh yeah, we're definitely in the... Yeah! Is that going to finish the battle? No, it didn't finish the battle. Okay. Alright, well, we got a capture. That's cool. Let's see if we can find anybody else. Maybe we can find somebody to go fight. Pinging, I've got her coming from behind me, which should be my teammates. Yeah, all my teammates are taking off right now. Well, let's see if we can find anybody. I don't don't think I got very much score for the capture at all, but we got the capture, so that's cool. We can only fly so fast. Definitely going to be too close to the, uh... AI AAA from the convoy there. Now where, oh where is that, I wonder? Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, Good kill. Good kill. That'll do. So I dropped napalm and then I just went rockets for the rest of the way and I got 30,000 RP out of that. So 456 zoom, or 456 Mighty Mouse rockets is quite lucrative in the RP world. Eh. Quite lucrative RP wise. Uh, not terrible in the Silver Lion world either. I didn't have any... I did have a booster on at the beginning. I'm sorry. I had one booster on for the first 30 minutes. This battle was a lot longer than 30 minutes, but that's cool. How much did we actually get from that, I wonder? Uh, yeah, about 38,000 of it was from the booster. So a lot of it was just rocket damage to the airfield. So we actually scored really well. Uh, certainly a lot of that was also because we won, which definitely helps. But yeah, like that. Let's see what uh, RP we can get here. Or modifications, I mean. What can we spend our RP on? Okay, 23,000 to go. That damn near spaded the aircraft out. I guess we'll take uh, we'll take the 17,000 here for that great big 17,000 bonus, and we'll put most of it into the Sidewinders. Boom! The handy little bit there. And we put the rest into here, about half of it, so... Not bad, we're nearly there. One more lobby ought to just about spade it out, so let's go do that. Oh, the radar's not spinning. That's lame. Ooh, I say. Ah, where are we? Okay. Farthest west. Alrighty. Whoop. 
Don't drag the wingtip. Don't drag the wingtip. That would be very bad. Okay. Speed's good. Let's head in for the target. All right, we're here. Go say hello. Attention to the designated grid zone. Attention to the designated grid square. There went one of my bombs. That'd be the 750. That was hilarious. Can't see the bomb sitting, that's too bad. Get a little farther clear of the airfield, I'm gonna dive and fly home at ground level. I kind of like that landing. I got a little squirrely down the runway, but otherwise, I like that one. I felt pretty good. Successful sortie. I saw somebody over the mountain, but I'm not sure now. Well, yeah, I did. I did. I did see him up there. Okay, well, that's where the MiG-23 is. Okie dokie. Battle's gonna end before I get to get within visual of him. As soon as we capture that zone, it's pretty much gonna be over. He's up here somewhere. At 435 tickets left, I think we're gonna win as soon as they finish that capture. No, not yet. Yeah, I thought so. Well, all right then. I got one bomb run in, then got shot down on my second bomb run in, and that is going to spade it out. I got like twice as much RP as I needed, so I guess that's okay, because we can wrap this up now, but that'll do it. There she be. There she be. Okay. Now, I could bring more Sidewinders if I wanted to. I don't think I can add extra Sidewinders to uh, any of my bomb loadouts. But let's see. Go up to... Uh, see if we can add any here. I don't suppose I... No, it's got to just be those two pylons. It must You must be limited to just two unless you put them on probably the internals, I bet. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's fine. It's a little disappointing. I can't put a couple extra sidewinders out on the outboard pylons, but it's probably fine. Honestly, two is enough because they're only AIM-9Bs. Yeah, I guess these are probably the only places you can have them. So that makes sense. 
But there we go. One spaded out F111A. All done in sim. And uh, pretty good progress on my F4J. We'll keep working on that. Probably do a little more mixing up which aircraft I use to unlock it. But uh, yeah. There we go. I still haven't flown my F15A yet. I don't know if I want to do it in sim or do it in RB. I don't know. Anyway, thanks for watching, everybody. We'll see you in the next one. Thanks very much for uh, tuning in. If you watch this entire playlist, I really, really, really appreciate the uh, support. So thank you all very much out there. And we'll see you in the next new vehicle video. Take care, everybody. Good luck with your grind.